transness is characterized so much by struggle and suffering and difficulty, and I think most representations and stuff like that still miss the wonderful joy of it. Really nice moments of like feeling at one with yourself while you're with your friends, feeling unequivocally yourself in a way that I don't think that many people have because they've never had to grapple with what their self means as a concept. Those moments offset with the difficulty, offset with that, and in contrast with that, that really makes like trans joy. For people to be able to see that this isn't going anywhere, and like maybe if so many people are celebrating diversity, then maybe it's time to start to rethink how you think of gender and how you think of these binaries. Gender dysphoria for me is fear. It's a fear of looking in the mirror and worrying that how I present and how I feel don't align. A fear of feeling invalid or, you know, not good enough. Yeah, it's, it's all fear for me. But it's really not about being transgender, it's about being you. It's about me being me and giving myself permission to be me. And the joy in that is one that I didn't even know was an option. We are Trans Matters Worldwide. We are just a group of regular, normal people who happen to be transgender, and we want to uh, get that message out into the world. What is Transgender is a web series that we shot over the summer and are hoping to bring to you at the start of 2024. It comprises of three films. What is Trans Joy? What is Trans Pride? And what is Gender Dysphoria? There has been a very anti-trans narrative going on in the press and across the world and so we are here to show the real lives of real people who live this real existence every day and how it is not such a negative experience, how there is so much joy, positivity and exuberance inside people's lives. What we're doing is we're holding an online premiere at the end of February to help raise money for a second season. This will allow us to increase our voice and increase where we are heard across the world and it is your opportunity to be involved in that and have a say in what it is that we cover. Everything I've ever made is incredibly personal to me. I don't think that's a wild take for any filmmaker to say. But more than anything else, I think these films are the films I would have wanted to see when I started my transition. We hope you'll join us at the start of next year.